What's going on, YouTube? My name's Lefty Jones. You guys can just call me Lefty, and we're here today on number 11 of our Pokemon X and Y Live Wi-Fi Battles. We're here with Flora, another person that I have found out of Cerebi.net chat. That seems to be the place to go when I cannot get some response on my Twitter, but that's kind of what I'm expecting this early on in the channel. We will eventually get to the point where people will uh, start responding to my re... re uh, um, battle request, because I do ask in the weir weirdest times of day. It's not your all's fault, it's, it's totally my fault, because I'm, I'm terrible at scheduling things, but Flora here is wanting to battle, and I will get on into this battle, and we'll just see. I asked for an NU, t an NU battle. She didn't know what NU was, so we'll just see how this turns out. I have no idea. She is bringing, oh, she's bringing the Azumarill and the Mega Kangaskhan, so that's something we're going to have to deal with, but... But, 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 she's, I've got, okay, so anyways, anyways, I've got Choice Scarf, Typhlosion, Focus Sash, Crawdont, um, Leftovers, Leafeon, new member of the team, Chloe, is her name for, uh, Chlorophyll, I think it makes sense, it makes sense, it makes sense, we've got Primeape, one of my, all, he is my favorite fighting type of all time, Primeape, hands down, I don't care what his stats look like, he's my favorite fighting type, he's got the, uh, the Choice Band to give him that boost, and we've got Kansu on here with us, I think y'all haven't seen him since, um, since, uh, our first Wi-Fi battle, Kansu is Zatu, of course, he's the, uh, you know, Light Clay, and we've got Tectonix, the Steelix, who are, is our uh, other defensive wall next to Leafeon. She's got the Blissey Azumarill once again. Oh, all this fun stuff. And Electros, another Electros, two days, two days in a row, and Electros, and a Ditto, that's, that's different. Okay, so we've got, we've got a few different options. I almost, I'm going to open up, unless, I think she'll open up with Crobat to U-turn out, so I'm going, or Azumarill, expecting the, uh, Tectonics. I'm gonna go into Kansu, because I don't, th I don't really see anything except the Electros that's super effective on Kansu. Set up my light, or my light screen, set up my, uh, Reflect, or Barrier, is it Reflect or Barrier, whichever one. Flora, I hope you have a great game, I hope you have a great game, Flora. And, uh, let's just get this underway, we'll just see what happens, I'm... I have no idea. I'm, let me let me let's see what music this is. Oh, this is that Team Flare music, isn't it? Sending out the Ditto. Sending out the Ditto. That's weird. What did I send out with Konsu? Oh, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks. Does it have Imposter? I'm sure it does. Yes, it does. That's not good for us. That's not good for us at all. That thing, doesn't it get the ability to? Wow, that really, 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 really sucks. That truly, truly sucks. I'm going... That was a really, really good play. That was a really good play. That was the last thing I was expecting. So you know what? I'm setting up my reflex. If she's going to set up her reflex, I'm setting up my reflex. I saw a lot of uh, physical attackers on her team. She's going to use foul play. My attack sucks. So, I mean, it shouldn't do too much. Wow, that does a lot more than, it, than I wish it would have. But we are getting a reflect up getting a reflect up so that's quite all right somehow that ditto is faster so i guess it's holding that that powder whatever that stuff is i'm gonna do a roost since we have our reflect up hopefully she switches out she's gonna set up a reflect of her own i'm gonna roost up and then i'm assuming that we're both gonna go for light screen and then this is just gonna be a reflect light screen match however it may end up turning in my favor because I do have the light clay that will benefit us. I am almost certain that that thing is not holding the light clay. I'm going to go ahead and set up my light screen. I see no reason not to. I'm sure she will too. I'm sure she will too. Yes, she will. Oh no, Kansu went first, so I guess it's a speed tie. It's a speed tie. It's a speed tie. Oh yeah. Oh, 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 oh. She's setting up her own light screen. Setting up her own light screen. So now it really just depends on whatever, whatever. This, I'm going to foul play. I don't see any reason not to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna foul play. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Does a little bit. Does a little bit. Ditto's not using. Ditto's not. Uh, but it, it's just gonna have Roost too. It's gonna have Roost too. Hers doesn't do as much. But I mean, she's just gonna have Roost too, so it's not really gonna matter. I almost just wanna. You know what? I'm just gonna stay in here because we can both do this. One of us is gonna switch out eventually, though. One of us is going to have to switch out eventually. I think she's about to opt. I think she's opting to switch out. I think she is. Either that or she's just going to roost. Which wouldn't honestly benefit anybody. She is going to roost and this is... This literally... This turn doesn't even matter. It's like this turn does not even matter. But here comes my foul play. 
think I'm a little bit more powerful than her for some reason. I think so, anyways. I have no idea. Mine, mine seemed to hurt a little bit more. Maybe it was max damage. Maybe it was min damage. I have no idea. The only reason I'm not switching anyone else is because I don't really have anyone that can... I mean, I have people that can take a foul play. I just don't have anyone that can just take this con... This, this Kansu imposter. Look at these things. Look at these things out here together. Oh my god. That's, that's got to be the freaking thumbnail right there. Right there. I'm just going to keep foul playing. I'm, I'm sorry if this isn't... Is the, oh, she's withdrawing. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I think she's eventually predicting... Oh, that's good, that's good. So we will use his... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Doesn't that mean we use his attack? I think it does. I think it does. Uh, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. He is going to set up... I don't know. Is he going to sucker punch or is he going to dizzy punch? God, I hate Mega Kangaskhan. I despise Mega Kangaskhan. I almost want to go into my, my physical wall tectonics. Because I don't think... Unless I can... Can Kangaskhan learn, run superpower? I don't think it can. I want to go into Caesar, but Caesar... Caesar the, the prime ape, of course, named after, um, you know, Planet of the Apes. I'm going to go into Tectonics, because I don't think... Oh yeah, she had the barrier up. That's why they didn't do diddly squat. That's why, because... Not the barrier. You know what I'm talking about, the light screen. What it, not even the light screen. Blah, blah, blah. Of course, it's a Mega Kangaskhan. However, will Lefty handle this Mega Kangaskhan? Will the Mega Kangaskhan just wall out Lefty completely? Go for a Sucker Punch. Or a Fake Out. I don't care. Go for a Sucker Punch. Yeah, it failed. It failed, you... So, what? Her thing wore off, and... Or was that mine? I have no idea. I'm setting up my Stealth Rocks, because I think she's going to have to switch out. Because I don't think it has anything for Steel. It's I really don't, unless she has a Fighting-type move. But I still think we can take it. I still think we can take it and its little baby, its little baby form. Stupid baby form. I hate Kangaskhan so much, and I hate Ditto. Oh, apparently Ditto turns back into its normal form. That's wonderful. Wunduva! That's just great. So now we have to basically counter my very own Steelix. So that's great. Luckily, my Steelix is defensive, not offensive at all. And now, I, you know what? You know what? I'm going to roar. I think I'm fast. I might be faster. I don't know. I, it might. It's gonna set up stealth rocks of its own. I don't have any. Ah, oh, that sucks. Cause I don't have any defogger. I don't have any rapid spinner. I didn't even think about that. Unfortunately, something's gonna come out here to this. Kangaskhan's gonna come back out here, so we can maybe force another switch. So that's a good thing. Just about. Just about. It's a good thing. Just about. Yes, sir. Rebob, it is. So I think she's gonna go right back. She's probably gonna go into a zoom roll at this point. But I'm going for an earthquake. I'm just going for that stab earthquake. It can go for sucker punch. It can do whatever it wants. That thing has nothing on Steelix. That thing has nothing on Steelix. We're about to find out right now. Yeah! Eat it up, Tectonics! Eat it up and get hurt by the Rocky Helmet. I forgot what I put on this thing. Yeah! That's right! That's right! You get hurt by that Rocky Helmet. Kill this thing! Kill it! Stab earthquake! I know I'm not offensive. Wow, that didn't... That did less than I needed it to. But... The Kangaskhan's almost dead, and that's a plus for everybody. Did he had the um, he had the levitate? He had the levitate. Um, you know what I'm talking about. I'm gonna go for an Iron Tail, expecting the Electros. No, oh no, that's not good. Oh, can we eat it up? We are eating it up. Wow, taking himself out with the Rocky Helmet doesn't even get the baby hit. Doesn't even get the baby hit, Kangaskhan. I hate you so much, Kangaskhan. I cannot, I, 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 all, I really want to do a battle, you know what, no I don't, I'm not even going to lie to you guys, I don't want to do, I wish I could say I want to do a battle spot series, and I probably will in X, or I mean Oras, but right now, I can't handle every single match, Charizard X, Charizard Y, Azumarill, um, Kangaskhan, freaking, god, it's just too much, it's too much, Talon Flames all over the place, it's just, it's just Ubers and freaking OU, and you, I, I, I like using I like using these Pokemon. So out comes Azumarill. Out comes Azumarill with a Play Rough or a Belly Drum. He's probably... Honestly, Tectonics has really done his job. I think so, anyways. God, I hate when these things Belly Drum. I hate when these things Belly Drum. And this is one of the situations where Belly Drum could pretty much, you know, destroy my team. It could. So you know what? Just in case... Just in case he doesn't go for Aqua Jet or Waterfall or whatever he's going for, I'm going for an Earthquake. 
I'm going for an earthquake. No, there's the play rough. I resist that. I resist that, buddy. You weren't expecting that. I should have went for the iron. Well, no, iron tail would have been neutral, just like earthquake. Earthquake is more power, so this was the better choice in the end. Yes! Yes, he was predicting. What was he predicting me to go out into? Let's see, what would that have hurt? I guess it would have hurt Caesar. Caesar would have got hurt super effective by that, but I'm... Screw it. I'm going for Earthquake. Go ahead and do your Hydro Pump. Miss. Never mind. He's not going to miss. He's going to take out. Tectonics goes down. Is that not a good name for a Steelix? I think it is. I think it's a really cool name. But we have to see what our next, the next contender of this battle is going to be. Chloe. Chloe the Leafeon. Is that not a good name? Also, Chloe with Chlorophyll. I don't know. I thought of Chlorophyll and then that name popped. It just went into my head. Popped up into my head. But I'm going to knock off whatever feels like coming out here. I don't think Azumarill is going to stay in here because he really doesn't have power for it. So I think he's going to switch into, or she, I should say, she's going to switch into perhaps a fire type. Once again, you know, you, you guys should know by now that I don't take pictures of my teams, but something is getting knocked off and it's not going to be a Megastone. It's going to be the Crobat. Crobat coming on out here, the girly boy Crobat. And Chloe's just going to knock it off. He says, knock it off, Crobat. Knock it off. Knocking off the poison barb. What would that do? What would that do? What can he do? That... I'm trying to think. I really have no idea. I have no idea. I run Microbat Knock Off. Or, I mean, not Knock Off. Life Orb Infiltrators to break through those stupid substitutes that people like to do. But we have a Brave Bird coming our way. We can't just sit here and let... Well, well we can't really let anybody take that, honestly. Nobody can take a Brave Bird. Wow, that sucks. That's unfortunate. Wow, that's really unfortunate, actually. Hmm. 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 I, I need, I need Chloe. Chloe walls out Azumarill. I could bring Nibbles down to his Focus Sash. And then... Hmm. 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 Or I think Waggish Typhlosion. That's that, I named it Waggy T in honor of you, Waggish Typhlosion. If you are listening in, I figured I'd make my own Waggish. I'm going to go ahead and stop Lollygag and I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to send out Nibbles. I've got Typhlosion and Feraligator in the same game. Poor Meganium does not get any love this game, maybe in the future. Nibbles is probably going down, down to a Brave Bird, but that- oh no. Oh, I forgot about the stones. Poison Fang. Oh, okay. We can live that. We can live that. I run Cross Poison on mine, but that's quite alright. I'm gonna Dragon Dance, thinking that she doesn't have Brave Bird. She might not. I run Brave Bird on Microbat. Brave Bird freaking cross poison u-turn taunt oh my god you kidding that thing forces so many switches and you can get u-turn off for the list initiative ah, the initiative that that life orb gives it that little bit of extra power it's very nice it's very nice what is that thing's name zapple zapple rock zapple rock i got my dragon dance off so i do outspeed this thing even though i thought i did anyways but i think that i should ah, poop i forgot to put waterfall on here i meant to put waterfall on here I think I'm just gonna go for a crunch. I don't see why not to. It's not gonna have any sort of, any sort of special. Or I mean, it's gonna kill me. But I think this this will do some hefty damage. It's a Feraligator. Come on, do some hefty damage. Plus one crunch. Do it. It's not. Wow. Wow. Nibbles. Nibbles. I am disappointed in you, buddy. I am disappointed in you, buddy. I'm sorry. You. 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 You let me down right there, buddy. You let me down right there. I'm, I can't do anything about that, Nibbles. There is nothing I can do about that. I have a safe switch in right now to Caesar, the amazing Prime Ape. The amazing, amazing Prime Ape, just to get him some action. Look how pumped and ready to go he is. Look at him. He's just, he's, look at it. Look at it. Look at, I love Prime Ape. I've loved him forever. He's got close combat, U-turn, Stone Edge, Ice Punch, Choice Ban. I'm going for the close combat. I know I outspeed that thing. It is a dead Zoppelganger. It's gotta be. Choice band, fighting type, stab, prime ape, getting a kill. What do you know? I love this. I'm loving this all the all day, every day. Caesar is hurt by the Rocky Helmet. So that thing had Rocky Helmet of all things. That was an odd I guess it's not an odd choice. Rocky Helmet's really good on any bulky Pokemon, and that thing seemed to be pretty bulky as it ate up Nibbles Crunch. Ate it up. And you know what? No matter what you do, Azumarill, no matter what you do, I think Chloe's got this. I think Chloe can eat up your physical attack. You don't have a stupid freaking belly drum off. You don't have a belly drum. You're yellow. You're not blue. You're feeling sick, Azumarill. You're not feeling right. 
don't you dare get a crit, don't you dare kill us, we're physically defensive, max, max defense, max HP, leftovers, eat it up, Chloe, Chloe hogging the spotlight right now, I am loving it, loving it, loving it, so either she's gonna switch out or let this thing die, either way, I'm doing a synthesis, so I can get some health back, get a little bit of health back, and I do outspeed the Azumarill, oddly enough, I didn't expect that, I didn't expect in sim synthesis. That synthesis. I didn't expect synthesis. Well, we're not really. Yeah, we're in a pretty. We're in a better position. Never mind. That wasn't for nothing. That was not for nothing. But um, I didn't think synthesis did that much whenever the sun isn't out. So I guess it's when the sun is out. Does it do just like? Does it fill up your HP automatically? I'm gonna do a leaf blade. Take care of this Azumarill. Leafeon, Chloe getting a kill. Did I make Chloe a girl? I really hope I did. I probably didn't. I pro oh, I did, I did, I did. Okay, okay. Chloe is a girl, matching her beautiful attire. Chloe, I almost named it Cersei, because I always... All the beautiful Pokemon, I almost want to name Cersei or Daenerys. Because it's just... Those are such beautiful names. Whoever thought of those, George R. R. Martin, man? Oh my god. Those are beautiful names. Such a great name for queens and stuff for a mythical land. But this isn't about Game of Thrones. We have a Blissey in front of us, which probably, I'm assuming, knows Ice Beam. But, uh... I think we can live one. I believe we can live one. I'm gonna go ahead. Do I want to set up? I'm gonna knock off just to just to see what it does. I'm gonna knock off whatever I probably leftovers, assumingly leftovers. There goes the leftovers. That's good. It's gonna toxic us, oddly enough. So that's a good thing. I mean, it's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. But it's not an ice beam. It's not an ice beam. Maybe it has flame. Well, flamethrower is just as bad. But almost all blissies that I know run minimize and uh toxic not toxic but i don't know i don't know usually thunderbolt flamethrower ice beam one of the three it gets all of them but i'm just i almost want to go for a sword zance to get some extra coverage and the part of me doesn't want to i'm gonna go for that stab leaf blade actually because i think that'll hurt pretty bad i think it's gonna hurt pretty bad maybe a crit gonna be a two just about okay it's gonna play this game it's gonna play this game it's gonna play this game, so I am setting up a sword to dance. You can go screw yourself, Blissey. You and your big, fat, bulky egg. You, what are you even doing here? You're clearly not fit for a battle. What if someone uppercutted you in the stomach and cracked that egg? You would be a worthless mother. You are a worthless person, Blissey. I am gonna sword dance up and not have these shenanigans, unless it all of a sudden pulls an ice beam out of its butt. But she is gonna withdraw, allowing me to get the free sword dance. Crowback coming on out here, which means we don't even get to use our sword dance. Good play, though. Good play, though, on her part. Crowback's not gonna be able to take another set of stones to the butt, though. I don't think. And that's a little bit unfortunate for her side. That's a little bit unfortunate for her side. I did just waste getting a sword dance off when a synthesis would have been the better case, or any move for that matter, as it would have killed the Crobat. But that just wasn't the case. Nobody can really take... Well, she's going to go for cross poison. It's going to be physical. I'm a physical wall. Maybe we can take it. I'm going to go for a synthesis just on the crazy chance that we do. It's going for the Beno Shock. Oddly enough, we might be... We are dead. We are a dead Chloe. Chloe, you did your part. That was probably my fault. I could have switched out. I definitely could have switched something out into that, but that's okay. That's quite, quite, quite all right. Quite all right. I'm gonna send Konsu back here. Set up my, set up my beautiful, beautiful barriers. He's gonna dig the stones. Dig the stones. I'm actually, actually, I don't. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the foul play for the kill. I need the kill. I want the kill. Withdraw. She's gonna withdraw. She's gotta withdraw. Come on, withdraw. 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 Well, I'm max... Well, no, I'm max special defense. That's the thing. I don't think we... Oh, no. Acrobatics? What? Why? Oh, yes! Yes! Why did she go for acrobatics? I have no idea. Cross poison probably would have done the job. I have no idea, but... Oh, my God. I'm so glad she didn't have Brave Bird. Any other person that run, runs Crobat probably would have had Brave Bird or something more powerful. Sending out Ditto. So we're playing these games again. That's fantastic. That's just lovely. That's just lovely. Just hunky freaking Dory. Hunky freaking Dory. Waggy Waggy T waiting in the background. I'm gonna do a roost just on the off chance that she outspeeds. Konsu does outspeed this time. We get a roost off. That's a good thing. This match is becoming a little bit long because of this ditto that keeps coming out here on my Konsu, which is very annoying, I might say. 
but this may be a two hit KO actually, it's almost a one hit KO. So she doesn't set up her, I should have just went for foul play, come on, outspeed again, Konsu. Nope, 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 I should have went for foul play. I really, really should have, now that I'm thinking about it, I thought she was going to set up her barriers and whatnot. But, let me see here, I'm pretty sure that, let me see here, what's, what's Konsu's speed, 116? And Caesar's speed is 160. Oh yeah, Caesar can outspeed this thing, no problem, no problem whatsoever. Caesar can come on out here and just do some hefty freaking damage to this Konsu, who normally would be totally, totally walling this thing out. But my Konsu does not have any psychic type moves or flying type moves. He just simply has a a dark type move, which we can easily learn live easily easily and I'm going for the stone edge I'm going for the stone edge come on land it yes yes you're a dead ditto goodbye ditto goodbye you're no more fall down to the ground you are a fake Konsu you are not the real Konsu even though you killed the real Konsu I'm the real Konsu I broke the dam freaking Blissey good lord good lord I hate Blissey I despise Blissey I really wish we could go for a close combat and end this deal, but it's gonna go for a for a soft boiled. I would imagine I'm gonna go for a stone edge because I am, I am freaking choice banded. Come on, land it, break its break its health. Yes, Primeape sweeping up three kills. I think three kills. I think I do believe. Flora, great game, great battle. I know I asked for an Inu battle, but it's quite alright that you didn't bring Inu Pokemon. It's quite alright. We do sweep us up a win. Great battle. Hope you check out my channel. And hope you guys, as always, like these videos. Please hit that like button as it shows you support these videos and want to see ORAS and want to see Art Academy, want to see Lefty Locks, want to see Wi Fi battles. I'm doing a lot of things for you guys if you think about it. So just take two seconds out of your day, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time, guys. Have a great night.